Well, here we are in the Holt and the Clay, and they're just about to set off to Cleethorpes. It's a lovely, lovely sunny day, very warm. And I've got the camera just sat on the dashboard in the corner. A bit clearer than the last time I did this because I didn't clean the windows. But today the windows have been cleaned and uh, it looks a lot uh, brighter. It does surprise me really how the camera manages to stay steady when there's nothing pinning it down. It's just that's on the dashboard. On a mouse pad. Well, mouse pads don't slip, so it's probably that that's helping it stay steady. Anyway, we're just coming to the main road. This is the main A16. If you go uh, left you're on your way to Louth which is a market town and a very popular place you have a lovely market it's on a Wednesday and it's about 12 miles to the left we're going right on the way to Cleethorpes or Grimsby you can go to from this direction both around about 5 miles in either direction I didn't realise the wiper blade was showing, but um, it doesn't uh, distract the view. On the left we're coming up to the actual garage that I bought this car from, brand new, seven years ago. There it is. They don't own it anymore, it's changed hands. On the right there's a petrol station and another garage forecourt. This is what I should have done at Holton Clay traffic lights when I got held up. I was straight on the move because I got held up there. This is Tollbar roundabout, very busy roundabout. Tollbar school is to the left there. If you bear left at this roundabout you can go into Grimsby that way, which is a slower route. We're going right onto the New Peaks Parkway. I say new, it's been built a few years now. In actual fact I think they've resurfaced it at least twice. But I don't think it's been built any more than 10 years, could be even less. It's been a godsend to people living this way to get into Grimsby. There's a few traffic lights along the way to Grimsby, but if you're lucky and you get straight through them, you can be in Grimsby in about 10 minutes from where I set off.
we're going to turn right on the way to Cleethorpes this is the junction on a roundabout of the Peaks Parkway what used to be where that car's going up there we used to be the railway line from Grimsby to Lowth Before this road was uh, built, traffic coming towards this direction had to turn right into the village of Waltham, New Waltham, or Old Waltham, that is. And since this road's been built, it's taken a lot of the traffic away from the village. As you can see, it's, it's always well used. Coming up to a set of traffic lights. On the right, there's a big car showroom. All these have been built in recent years, and there's a huge Tesco supermarket petrol station. That's if you turn right at the traffic lights, we're going up to the roundabout. We're going straight over. Turn left takes you into another route into Cleethorpes town. If you turn right, you're heading for the quieter end of Cleethorpes, and all the caravan area is that way. We're going straight over this roundabout down Taylor's Avenue. Very busy roundabout there, especially at uh, peak times. This is Taylor's Avenue which has been here as long as I can remember but on the right they've built a lot of new estates private estates I think maybe some council uh, uh, houses there there will be and some uh, pensioners housing I seem to be flying along today, there's not many hold-ups at all. Speed limit along this part is about 40 mile an hour. We're coming up to an area now where it changes to 30 miles an hour. I'm going to turn left at this roundabout. If you go straight on, you come to Cleethorpe Seafront. But I'm going to turn left here. And I'm going into the main shopping area. I 
and I'm going to turn right to this roundabout. It's just a quicker way of getting into the town, if you know. We turn left here. You see the beginning of the main shopping street in Cleethorpes. go straight on at this roundabout you find all the shops in Cleethorpes and car parking and everything. But I'm going to turn right. That's the council car park and uh, on the left you may not see it but on the left is the Cleethorpes Town Hall but I'm going to turn right. That's as far as I'm going on this particular film. I've got some business to do at the bank, so we'll leave it here and continue in another film.